I'm Rachel from Rugby Art Gallery Museum and I'm here to show you our craft kits that we have created for you to use at home. These are available for you to buy from Rugby Visitor Centre which is located in the foyer of our building. There are several craft kits available. In this video I'll be showing you the contents of our print making kit. I'll also be giving you a suggested craft for you to make at home with the contents inside. However, this is just a suggested craft. Please feel free to use the contents however you wish. Okay, before we get started on the suggested craft, we're just going to take a look inside the kit and I'll show you what materials you have and anything else that you might need to find from your craft supplies at home. Okay, let's take a look what's inside the printmaking kit. These kits very handily come in these zipper bags, which are really useful for storing other craft materials. And inside the bag you have got a roller, a tool, some polystyrene sheets, a tray, and also on the back of the cover are some instructions and some inspiration. So from home you will need to find some paint, a blunt pencil, or you can use the tool, and some paper. Okay, so the first thing you want to do is make sure you've protected the surface you're working on and wear an apron as well to protect your clothing. The first step is you want to take your polystyrene sheet and you want to use the tool provided or a blunt pencil to lightly press your design into the sheet. Now, the inspiration that you'll find on your instruction sheet within the kit is the fishwife, which is a liner cut that's been printed on this paper. So this here, I'm gonna take inspiration from the artwork in which there are some fish within the piece of artwork. So as you can see, I'm just pressing lightly into the polystyrene. So when we say press lightly, because otherwise if you press too hard, you'll find that your pencil or your tool just goes straight through the sheet. Okay, so my fish. And then I think what I'll do here, a bigger fish. So you might also want to use a pencil to plan your design first. So you could just draw your design, if you're not confident, onto the polystyrene sheet first. Okay, so I'm just going to add some extra bits there, like bubbles. And the fish. Okay, so once you're happy with your design, you want to pick a colour of paint, add it to your paint tray, not very much, a small amount, about the size of a 2p coin, and then take your roller and you want to start to what we call like ink up your roller. So start picking small amounts of paint and dragging them down across your tray in different directions. Lift up your roller as well, like so to make sure it's nice and evenly covered. So keep taking a look at your roller and looking to see if the paint's evenly distributed on the roller head. So keep moving it about until it's all covered with paint. to do then is hold your polystyrene sheet and run the roller over the top like so, making sure all of it's covered. You can run it across in different directions, 
I think I might put a bit more paint on that. Okay, run over again. As you can see, as our design is starting to be revealed. So one last ink up. Okay, I'm happy with that. And then you want to take your paper, pick up from the sides very carefully. I'm going to turn over, place onto the page, and then press down lightly and just rub all over. So nice and evenly across all of the sheet. Very gently start from one edge of the polystyrene sheet and peel back away from the paper and reveal your image. Right, so what you could do next is you could clean this off and add another colour to your paint tray and create a repeat pattern across your paper. Or you could just leave your picture like that. Um, have fun with your with your printing and please show us what pictures you create. Thanks for watching this video. Don't forget that there are other craft kits available and tutorial videos to go with them. Just visit our website to see more.